Tango 1 will be 1041, turn 8. Tango 7 will be turn 8. I can hear you, but you're quiet. Damn. Premier 1, active EMS command in med 2 at the moment. There's not much I can do about that one. It, it does work though, which is good. <clears throat> oh yeah, unmute my radio. Radio might help. It might help. I can't wait for this new update to come out and all the Christmas stuff is gone. Mm hmm. Surprised they haven't just got rid of all the Christmas stuff sooner, to be honest. No. Is it out where you? It's on the highway. I can't remember what in state it is. Number 69. Yeah, I'm going to slow code 2 so I can get rid of these fucking street lights. Medic. Medic 10 responding Holy to a motor vehicle collision. Yeah. Jesus. Yes, he's loud. <laughs> oh my god. You know when I said prepare to get deafened? <laughs> ah, I see. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't <laughs> joking. Back available. <laughs> Fuck me, man. That's. You know what, I can actually see my man. PDNFT, request your attendance to call 31. Tango 4 is 10-8. You respond to it, Ty, for us. Uh, to the RTC. Yes, please. I'll be with you when I can, I'm just currently chasing down someone from with Phil. No. Uh, Tango 4 on scene of event number 31. Behind you, Phil. Very nice. Oh. <coughs> and he's not compliant. Teddy. Ladder 1, uh, code 3 to bin 5. Benny so they've asked the for row. FD to go to an RTC and they go to a bin fire. Priorities, man, you know? <sighs> Ladder one is code Ladder one is code four. Patient two is also breathing and also has a pulse. I might have broken my game. Oh yeah. I can't do select the gun, can't interact with doors. <coughs> There we go, cam out of cam. Premier 
Romeo 1, pre alert yellow, uh, white male patient, uh, suspect neck injury and fracture. One point point one nine six. Why? He's all right. He's only had the two pints. Uh, the initial report we got that his leg has broken, but he's not in any immediate danger. Uh, Romeo. One met ten here. Nice hey, message. That's a backwards two. I'm searching around the back car. The area is quite big and open. Can I get an additional unit? Possibly a fire rescue or a PD? Uh, met ten, we have um, rescue one is heading to your location as well. Um, I guess once they arrive, try turning sirens on, all of that good stuff. Shout, call out and see if anybody's around while you're searching. Medic, med 10. You do also have Tango 7 heading your way to assist. Perfect, thank you. I just caught up with the truck. Oh, they sent the tanker truck up. <laughs> Romeo 1 to units arriving at search and rescue. Advise when you arrive to hit F2 to turn your map off. What? Very much, don't look at your map. Because Mun's hiding and you can see him on the map. Oh, don't look on the map. That's all it is. Nice orange orange. that again. F3? No. F2. F2. F1's your stats, F2's your map, F3's your calls, calls. and F4's your speed display. Uh, no, F5 is your speed display. F4 is Hello. your interactive menu. Hello guys. Okay, so I did an initial search of the car and I couldn't find anything. Uh, but in the area there's a wide variety of footprints, so I think it's best to all go a different direction and uh, search for the prints on the floor and see if we can find anyone. Uh, just keep in mind to call out and listen cl clearly if you hear somebody scream or yell. Uh, yeah, I might jump in the car though. Hello, can anybody hear me down here? Hello? Uh, I have eyes on. Okay, let's go with you. Where do you, where do you see someone? In the trees over there, not quite sure how we get to them there. The trees? To your right. Wait. To my right. Ah, there he is, okay. Let's see if we can safely go to him. Oh, I seem to be in a spot of bother. I'm sure. Oh, you seem very old. And Christmassy. Hello, sir, how are you? I am 52, how dare you, good sir. <laughs> sure, do you well, have any pain? Uh, yes, my left leg rather hurts quite a little bit. Uh, I seem to have fallen down the mountain. And, uh, it hurts, if you can see. Just a slight bit of bother. Okay, sir. How did you get here, sir? 
But what happens? Tiger, well, I was tiger. just having a walk up there, but then uh, I seem to have gotten tripped over my foot in my stupid old age and slid down the hill. And, uh, well, now I'm here. Uh, Romeo 1, Medic 10 here. Pass your message. Uh, Romeo 1, we have found the uh, old gentleman. Uh, he, is in, he is conscious and he is talking. Uh, his leg hurts, so we're gonna check out that further. We, if I have more information, I will let you know. Hello, sir. I understood, my turn. Do you have enough I, I can, uh, yes. personnel on site, or do you need additional? I haven't got that old yet, I can still hear. Uh, Romeo 1 requesting additional med units. The man looks very pale and a bone is sticking out of his leg. Well, maybe I'm just happy that, to see you. Ah, <laughs> oh, dirty old man. I see that. Okay, well, sir. You probably have a bit of sense of humor. Phil, when you and the game save the patient and check on him while I get my med back. Do you want me to run and grab the med bag and you stay with him? That's also good. Okay. Ladder 1 is on scene of vehicle fire. You and B, can you grab a stretcher? So we have that ready. And possibly some ropes to pick him up. Okay, sir, so you just keep laying down. I don't stand up, can no I? I'm in absolute agony though, is there anything you can give me for the pain? Yes, sir. We will give you something for the pain soon. Oh, thank god. No worries. Uh, Romeo 1, uh, to city-based units, just be advised to all EMS Here units are currently involved thank in you. the um, search and rescue. Okay, sir, can you go lay down please for me? And we will watch you. I don't really have a choice up. here. Any time I move, I'm just in absolute agony. Okay, well... Then, don't move, sir. We will, you will be alright. No worries. I hope so. Okay, sir, I'm gonna put a... Uh... Oh, fucking hell, I have to do the medic terms. Oh, gonna be, Jamer's gonna be so embarrassed of me here, sir. Who, who is Jamer? <laughs> is that like a proper toss bot? He's a real twat, but I will tell you about him later. Oh, thank God. It's yours, I know the Dutch term, but not the English term, so it's gonna be just one more to clear. <laughs> oh, I'm really bad on this. Are you sure you're qualified, sir? No, not at all. Because you seem to be just staring into my eyes like a romantic <laughs> film. Am I in trouble because the police are here? That sounds quite worrying. No, they're to help me to get you back up because it's quite a way up. So, no uh, worries. Are you not good enough? Do you need more people? Or what? what, what? I, don't, I don't know if I feel safe with you. You can feel safe with me, sir. No worries. I've been Is that a sexual sir. comment? Yes. How I've, dare been you? I've been trained by Jamin. Oh, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Policeman, what what will happen to my car? Because uh, obviously I can't drive. Uh, we'll just get a tow to come and pick it up. Okay, sir. Okay, sir. Let's take a look at the. You can drop it where you like. Oh, no, I would appreciate if you could take it to my house. That would be lovely. Sir, sir we're gonna stabilize your uh, leg wound first. You and B, can you get a fracture kit from my um, med car? Uh, yeah. That feels good. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. You bastard, you hit the bone. Ow. PD, can I have a unit to event 5-5? Five five. Oh, I've got a structure fire. Marco! Four, four, Hello. 
Turn four. Turn go four. Responding to event number. Four. Marco. Hello. Hello. Oh, I see you guys. More of you, Liza. Hello, sir. I'm sure, can you be uh, a little less? Good afternoon, sir. Madam, we have uh, one patient here. He looks very pale. Uh, put a. We're gonna put a fracture kit on the leg wound. There's one bone sticking out. I've pushed nets already. To relieve him of the pain. And it feels uh, okay. wonderful. If he is all stable, uh -huh. I want to get him up and transport him to the hospital as quickly so they can take a look at the leg wound. That sounds like an excellent idea to me. Uh, have we got backboard and the blocks here? Uh, no, not yet. I got okay. the stretcher oh. and I assume B to put up some ropes so we can uh, pull the stretcher back up with him on it. Jeez. Okay, it's probably going to be better to, since there's enough of us, probably be safer and much better for the patient if we do it on the backboard. Oh, hey, you'll be alright, sir. Ow. Don't worry, sir. It will be alright. Oh. Okay, you and me can you get back from my uh, meta. Yep. It's a very picturesque spot, this you've, you've chosen, sir. Well, like a mere weekly, it's a nice little walk path, you know? Yeah. But this time, uh, the absolute blithering idiot I am tripped over my legs, and, well, I came down here, and, uh, well, here you guys are. I'm not sure can you believe that. Yeah, these things happen. Yeah. Fuck's sake. Bye, Tango One. I believe that's swearing. He's got a busy daddy. His, his ears shouting at him and he's going to have a busy night. Oh. Oh, it's so I know what you mean. Bloody Irishman. Okay, so are you going to be alright um, to Hello, to pick your hands up and push yourself onto the, the backboard if we give you a little bit of help? The big old lady, how dare you. Um, sure, I, I can try, as long as I don't have to use my leg. No, no, that's the idea. Just kind of guide yourself on with your hands and, and we'll, we can do the rest. I feel like a slug. Okay, yeah, that's a good analogy. Okay, sir. Okay, okay, so <laughs> well, okay that's yeah. great. Tango eight, can I get your location? Wonderful. Okay, if you could just lie down for me, sir. What we'll do is we're just going to strap you in so we can carry you safely up the hill, without you know you sliding down. Okay, guys, one on each okay. corner. Uh, on the count of three, one. Two, three, lift. And nice and slowly up the hill. I feel like I'm flying again. Oh, this is delightful. You better not drop me. Have you been flying weak. often, sir? Um, only when I go down the hill. Quite quickly. Oh, but fair enough. So, it's, well. it's, <laughs> so we're just doing the reverse of your initial flying. I hope it doesn't end in the same way. Uh, me too. I like very strong. I attempted, but I will not, sir. We will get you there. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, if we head towards um, Med 10. How are you feeling temperature wise, sir? You, I'm not sure what clothing you've got on. Oh, you naughty, naughty man. It's a little bit brisk up here, but uh, not, I'm not too bad. Okay. Feel it sounds like you're, you're, you're quite experienced, so it sounds like you would have been well prepared for this. Well, yes. Um, has anyone brought my bag at all? Seven, just make sure I you fell run off and, uh, name for us, would you? I would like my bag. It wasn't the cheapest of items. Ah, not a problem. What we'll do is we'll get you loaded in, and then one of us will pop back for it. Oh, thank you. I'll be checking every item. I know what you need. Come on. Expired insurance. Come on, anything. Oh, that's which flight van is that? No, what's my mobile? Show Tango Seven on the Ten Eleven.
I have to win a lot, but like what? Well, a hundred. Not this round. It's very hard to win a lottery. If Falcon doesn't Take reply, I'm. A... Uh, go ahead. Can you shut down that beginner section we're coming up to, please? Ten four. Thank you. Actually appreciate it, thank you. No problem. Tango four back ten eight. Oh, what a surprise. What what's up? Actually I'm gonna go back and buy more lottos. Have driver license expired. I may run it. <coughs> I already run it all. Okay. You can also get a ticket for. Insurance expired. How many lotto tickets should I buy? Then I'd like you out of the car, please. I would say we have to, but he left. I know. This guy is pretty hammered. Um, big number uh, up between 100 and 1,000. I don't know where you're getting all of this money from. Yeah. He must be getting paid fucking well. Um, you got a transport van if you want to give it to him. Oh. If you want, it's just that. Ten four. What's the location? Sixteen thirty. Right, yeah, my ten rolling. Better move them down here, actually. Can I what get PD units on the lookout for a white crown Vic? I saw a white crown Vic. Uh, 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 speeding off from the scene. Missing all the investigation stuff. <laughs> I'm gonna tell him to actually look at the cameras. Yep. Um, he will. I just got a 999 call of um some the cashier getting shot. It's all white ground big. That just he uh, is lumped over. Uh, on the counter here. Okay, and you've got med on the way? Uh, yes. Do you want to go in back and pull out the CCTV? Sure. Um, I have a general direction on which, where the car went. We don't know if it's that car or not. Okay. They could have just had all the shots and decided they didn't want to be in the area anymore. Okay. Med Dan arriving on scene. Me, man. <laughs> Please, I'm bleeding here. Yeah, hold on. I'm just applying pressures here. Oh yeah, that really hurts. I'm not. I'm not gangster enough for this. Oh yeah. <clears throat> um. Voice is leaving. <laughs> well, you've got like been shot. It's a pretty cool story. All the med. It's a silly old man. Fuck Jesus. It's right here, man. Thanks. Hello, sir. I'm Paramedic Mellon with the, um, not San Andreas. This is Unknown Island, um, Fire and Rescue. I, I think you've been shot. I think that's pretty clear. Yeah, I don't feel like SpongeBob, if you know what I mean. Yeah. I'm the I, greatest I'll do a little bit, yeah. Yeah. Uh, Elite, can you just, can you grab the backboard and just some other things out just so we're ready? Yep. Did you get a look at the person that shot you? Well, they yeah, he was like some, uh, some old guy. You know, he just came in to buy some things, and then he says he's got no money. 
and he, he rang up his bank and they said all his he just spent all his money online to some Serbian guy. So then he just decides, instead of just you know, leaving peacefully, he just pulls his piece on me and goes, skip, bap, 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 bap. And uh, well, um, now I'm here. He's some old guy. He's got a wonderful beard, uh, no hair, but he's on crutches, if that helps at all. Um, he sort of hobbled um, away. It was quite funny. Bill, um, I just watched the CCTV footage. Um, um, I, I appear to have lost the ability to look at things, but um, I do a preliminary inspection. Um, you can just sort of see really on me. Reginald. I know, but I've lost the ability to text chat. <laughs> no, that's fine, because, you we know... We love this game. <laughs> it's just like, I've just got a big hole in my chest, you know? It's, it's, a, bit, it's a bit annoying. And, and he, oh, he seems to have got my arm as well. But actually, he sort of just scraped that. And I've been really going to the gym to try to work it. And uh, I think he's okay. just done all that work. Um, okay, yeah. no worries. Uh, Ali, can you take over from Phil in applying pressure? And I will just grab a bandage out. We'll start apply, putting some of that on. You seem to be breathing okay, so I'm just going to hug you up to an ECG and just make sure your pulse is okay as well. What's an ECG? You... That sounds so dope. Oh, it's freaking awesome, mate. Tells us all sorts of things that's going to... on inside of you through magic. Just... Grab the footage. It goes deep. Put it on a stick. Uh, yeah. Yeah, so it's watch deep. it. It's, Dope. um, Reginald. Okay. Well, we'll know that now. Can you possibly go out and look or stay with the victim? Um, I'll have a look out. I do have the Reg, um, I know the... Uh, what's on the edge guide, so. It has just been pinged on Route 4, so we're going to head out. Route 4, 10, 4, uh, do you want me to uh, uh, respond code Ooh. 1, is it? Uh, code 2. Oh, sorry, mate. <laughs> code 3 up code. to the scene, and then drop down when you get eyes on him, please. And 4. Well, it looks like uh, it, the, my left arm is just sort of a scrape, so it's just sort of pierced my skin. Not too badly, I haven't hit anything, you know. It's just sort of gone through, and, well, now it's ruined the, the cigarettes behind me. That's good. I'm going to pay for that now. Bloody, bloody old bastard. Um, one in the chest, I can't really see it. Um, but if I just feel my back, I can't feel a hole. Um, so I'm not like Iron Man. But, you know, got something inside <laughs> me still. I might, do I, does that mean I rattle? No, like if I do a quick like belly dance, we're like, ah, well, you, might let, ow, you might let ow, a few ow, different ow, things. Yeah, maybe don't do that. You should have told me that. You're the doctor, man. Not like uh, Doctor you... Who, you know, with his magic screwdriver, but, you know, I'm sure you've got some magic tool. Apart from that police officer, he's a proper tool as well. Ugh. Are you good without PD presence? Um, I think we'll be all right. I think we'll, um, we'll if you just call no. on to you and just stick here. Cool. Thank you. Bye, police man. <laughs> Please don't search me. Thanks. Bye. Bye. Oh, the boss is gonna kill me for this. Uh, well, do we have any doesn't... new? Okay. Is there an another ping update? Okay. Is there another update on the location? Because you said last location right four. Um, not currently. Uh, just drive up and down Route 4 for now. Okay. Um, it seems that it's an Uber driver. An Uber is a driver's car. Or, no, not Uber, sorry. Um, it's a rental. Okay. Let me just check which AMPR camera it was. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think um, Mr. Reginald isn't. He can be a bit crazy. Um, there, there is a area with building up at around sixty, seventy. You know that rough area. If you can just do a couple drive throughs obviously don't try to use the map too much because we obviously don't know what his whereabouts. Yeah. Uh, do you want me to go up to that uh, area and just... Just search areas as you go past them. Alright. Hmm. <laughs> 
<laughs> Try not to get too close when you spot him. Just mm -hmm. because he has a gun. Yeah. I will be calling 10.32. Give me a second, my phone is... I am getting a call. IRL. Medic 10, Prela, uh, Amber, with uh, one GSW stable patient. Okay, I'm gonna be coming towards you. Um, I got eyes on the vehicle through some tree lines. He seems to be going on that red, red, you know the area I was talking about, 60, 70 area? That road that's on that dot he's on. Cool, okay, well, wait for back Do you want me to turn around? Uh, just keep eyes on from a far distance for now. And four. There's no point in starting this shoot out if we don't need one. <coughs> um, you're coming up right for are you? Turn off. That's you. I oh, would. Is that you there? Turn. Yeah. yeah. And then I think it's a right, maybe. Was he heading in this direction then? Uh, yes. Bed 10 is returned to station. Okay. Well, I just get a lag spike, sorry. Alright, so if you don't mind going left, then I'll go right. Since you alright? If you go left, I'll go right. Yep. Yeah. Are there any tire marks on your side that uh, you're going? As uh, there seems to be none for me this way. Yes. That are I believe we've got um both Colonel Sanders have pulled them over. Oh hello, Mr. Policeman! Don't mind me, you go past. Uh do you want me to come to you as or yeah. That's a 32, please. Ex excuse me, you can't park there, sir. D do you mind? Okay. Learn to drive, you silly billy. Move that way. Sir, do you mind just pulling over for us? I mean, am I, am I in trouble, or...? Um, not if you just pull over for us. Well, I... Well, I would, but this van keeps hitting me like some sort of lunatic. Uh, yes, he'll just mind that little way for us. <clears throat> uh, what's the situation? Uh, we've just got him pulled over. Can you come and assist? Sure. Uh, I am... T minus five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Pull um up. pull up next to me. Just around here? Yeah. He does have a gun just so have your hand on your holster just in case. Yeah, I know. We're gonna order him out of the car. So do you um, mind stepping out of the car for us? 
Um, I don't. I don't really want to. No, it's quite warm in here. Yeah, I know. You can come sit in my nice warm car. It's nice and toasty. Well, I don't want toasty. You know, I've only got brittle skin. It's quite just the perfect temperature in here. I don't want to ruin the enzymes in my body. You know, science and stuff. Do you want me to go on the right side of this car? Um, just stay where you are currently. <coughs> Sir, we believe okay. you have a gun, so we'd just kind of like you to come out and talk to us. Um, so let's say I do have a gun. I don't, but let's say I do, hypothetically. So I'm just talking for a friend here. Um, what, what do I do next? Do I, should I just chuck it out the window? I mean, if you could just leave it in the car and come talk to us. I mean, no. Um, we get him to put his hand outside fine, the window. Fine, fine. I'm coming out, but um, bear with me because I'm on crutches, so this might, this might take a while. Okay, just keep an eye on. Yep, this is Mr. Reginald. Okay. He's... Uh... Ow! Um, can, can someone help me up, please? Um, I'm a bit old here. Wait! Okay, Colonel Sanders doesn't really... Do you want me to read him his rights? What the hell are you doing? Get your hands off me, you dirty, dirty man! If you can put him in the back of one car, search him and everything. Uh, then arrest him, legally bind him. Yes, Can't please. catch me. <laughs> Sir, please come to the back of my car. Just grab his cuffs and... No, I'm running away. <laughs> Can't catch me. I'm too fast for you. Get your hands off me, you blavering idiot. I would like to speak to your supervisor. How dare you? Yeah, okay. <clears throat> right. Now, nah, uh, will we just put him in the back of mine for now? <laughs> I don't know how he's doing that with his cuffs on, but... So just stick him in there for now. And like just... I said, the temperature in this car is absolutely appalling. Sir, stay in the vehicle. I was, I had a little muscle issue there. Yeah. The door's closed. Can't search me through a window, you fool. It's not very safe, is it? Okay, here's some naughty magazines, but keys. Um. Hey, that's my stuff, you fool. Give it back. Who do you think you are? Sir, You're I am. A public servant. I pay your wages. Well, I used to, but. I'm to put them on the on in the boot, and. Put it in the boot. Put it in my pocket. Okay, then. Yes, sir. Stay in the vehicle, sir. You walked away. That's your fault, you silly Battle fool. responding to 42, structure fire. Sir, get back in the vehicle now. I mean, I'd rather shot one, same trap. Fine. I mean, get your hands off me. I don't, I don't quite consent to you touching me. You dirty ass. Um, should I arrest them now, or do we want to wait? If you can Bill. read him his rights. Okay. Med 10, arriving on scene 180. 
Foxtrot one, same track. Oh. Ladder one on scene 180. Okay, he is gone. Well, uh, you know, thank you for what noticing. <laughs> it was hidden in your shoe. Yes, well, it's a good hiding spot. Sir, c can you just step into my vehicle? Uh, sit in my vehicle for a minute. Uh, yes, but uh, I seem to have dropped one of my crutches. So hang back with me just one minute. Let me just let me pick it up. Okay, I am taking out my non-lethal. Um, who is Kofi? Sir? Can't catch me. <laughs> well, but, I just grabbed you again, so... But then you let go to get my gun, you silly fool. <laughs> okay, I fine. just grabbed you there. Now, yeah, that's why I'm walking with you. Okay. I don't like that this officer's manhandling me. I feel like some third-rate citizen here. Well, if he just stayed in the car, it'd be okay. Well, he walked away. I thought I was good to leave. He didn't say stay in the vehicle. Okay, so stay you there. are being detained at this time. Well, thank you for finally telling me. I appreciate that. But no, well, no, I don't. But you know, whatever. <laughs> Sir, please sit in the car. Well, the, the van. Well, I mean, I'm very confused here. The van is just uh, spread you do... legs, and you, you're could telling you... me to get in the car, and this officer's telling me to get in the van. But then you, but ah, my head hurts. See, he's got air conditioning for me. Well, I have Peter. Um, uh, but it's too hot in here. One second, I can. Let me try. I, let me. Okay. All right. So can you read him his rights? Just before we yes. start questioning them. Sure. Um, hello, Mr. Hello. Reginald. Um, you yes, do not hello. have to say. You do not have to say anything, but a major like defense though. if you do not mention when questioned something which you later rely on in the court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand? Oh, I've got a lot to say. Could you just say that again? I didn't quite hear you. That last bit. You're, um, sir. You're under arrest. You do not have for to what? say. For shooting a man in a shop. What proof do you have? How dare! This is an outrageous claim. We have CCTV footage. I don't care. You can fake that. Okay. Sir. I uh, have CCTV sir. footage of you touching a child. What does that mean? It's outrageous. Yes, I was lifting my own child to bed. Did you ever well, think of that? Um, well, no, because I don't think about your child in bed. But you clearly do, you dirty, dirty man. See, officer, I want him arrested. Okay. Just, sir. Did you understand the rights? Uh, I'm reading them again because he's asking me to. Okay. Uh, sir, you're under arrest. You do not have to say anything, but it may harm your defence if you do not mention when questioned something which you later rely on in the court. Anything you do say may be given in evidence. Do you understand? Pardon? Yes, I understand. <laughs> okay. Um, you'll be... Um, will we bring him down to the station? Yeah. I just want to try and run a quick test first. Sure. So you do you not. consent to me getting a swab off your hands to check for the gunshot residue? No, oh, well, I mean, if you want to touch my hands, you're more than welcome to. Here you go. But I'm in sort of in cuffs, so uh, I'm a little bit restricted uh, here. Just by the looks of the gun, it was shot uh, recently, and there is a smell of gunpowder from it. Gunpowder, I'm not blowing up the uh, parliament. Out. What an outrageous In climate. a gun, there is gunpowder. I'm not blowing up parliament, though. This is Minecraft. My grandson plays Minecraft. Okay, sir. At this time, you are being arrested for possible manslaughter, attempted murder. It, oh, I didn't think he died. Not, not that I did anything, but you know, I didn't, I didn't think he died. I. But I didn't do anything, though. So that's why it's only attempted murder at this time, sir. Uh, no. I think it might just be best to leave him here in the car, cause uh, he, we don't want to hurt his leg. Well, you've already hurt my leg by grabbing me and dragging me across the floor like some sort of bear. Oh, goodbye. Hey, uh, will I bring him to station? Uh, you can take him to the station if you like. Okay. My legs are a little bit cramped here. Um, are you alright back there? Well, no. 
My legs cramped. It's too warm. The chairs um, aren't comfy. The AC is on. Yes, but oh. there seems to be some big barrier in the way. I don't know if you noticed. Oh yes, I know. Um, the re the re it would have been a lot worse in the uh, transport van because it's a lot smaller, and it's a, a small cage, and it kind of feels Your like oh. you're... naughty, naughty. Beautiful day outside, lovely weather. Oh, yes, it is. Ocean looks lovely today. Mm hmm, definitely. You can't roll, you can't roll down the window. The button's sir. there. I just did the button there. I didn't see it. Unless I'm hallucinating, they did give me some pain medication earlier. Oh. Yes, you are hallucinating. And it's probably just the AC that makes you think that the window's down. It does feel quite nice though. I can still go wee woo, wee woo, wee woo. You mean window. like this? Oh. Ooh, ooh. Now I feel naughty. Well, you have just been arrested, you know that, right? Arrested? What on heavens do you mean? I have not been arrested. How dare you? Do you not know who I am? I am Lord Reginald Dunsbury. Um, if you just give me a second here, sir. Are you all right back there? Oh no, I've been arrested. What a stupid question that is. I'm asking, um, are you, um, are your legs cramped? Well, yes. I've told you this before. I'm in absolute agony. Well, we're nearly at the police station. Structure fire event 180 is now code 4. Have you learned to drive recently, or are you just a complete idiot? Uh, they put a new curb. Uh, they put a little um, bit of a elevation. Um, yes, I could see. You went right up it and then went down. You absolute fool. Uh, sir, do you, um, do you just step out the vehicle there, please? Um, if you could sort of give me a hand as well, because... Like, you know, sort of cramped. Ah, oh, I, I, there we go. Oh, oh, ah, I've been here before. Okay. Yes. Remember, you got your car back here? Yes, I'll just go get it again then. And uh, no, your car isn't here. It is actually... Uh... Where is my car? That's are you there. talking about... Are you talking about the rental or the one that was at your house that time? I have two cars. Uh, the one that um, was at your the first card, the black one, um, that I believe was totaled. It was? It was a twin? Uh, How? Um, sir, can you just uh, follow me? Um, I am following you, you're over here. No, I'm at the ramp. What ramp? I'm not disabled. Sir, do you what? see me? Yes, you're over there. Why sir? are you going over there? 
I'm gonna grab you. Um, I'd rather you didn't touch me. Uh, it's okay. Bit, it's inappropriate. You, you see, you see the door over there. Yes, yeah, over there. No. There's into the no. booth over there. No, the door that you came out of earlier. In the police car. Do I have to? Do, do I have to? Um, walk Help him you find in. the way. Help him find the way. Sure. I hope you're not going to hold my no. hand. I'm not really into that. Um, I can see that. No. Why is there a police officer dancing over there? Go towards him. Walk towards him. I'm on my way, um, baby. It's... I'm coming. Nom nom nom. Oh, oh no, my uh, do, you, do you mind just collecting my slipper for me? My, uh... Would you like me to put it back on? Um, well, yes. I don't want God knows what on my foot. Um, yes, please. Just uh, avoid the avoid the feet. They're a bit smelly. Diabetes and all of that. Very <laughs> yucky, yucky. Oh, this is a very steep ramp. I feel like I'm at the gym again. Or I'm in um... the wall. Do you I tell you I was in the war? Do you want to, to bring him to the interrogation room, or do you want to book him? Book him first, or...? Right, you might as well book him. He's kind of got all the evidence we need here. Yeah. Uh, we can. Well, do you want to still ask him questions, though? Further questions? Uh, sir, if you just uh, go down these stairs to your right. Where's white? So oh, this one there. Yeah. Okay. Mm. Oh no. There's okay. Let's try it. Uh, Would you like to hop one. in the chairlift that we have, Jane? Uh, I can do it. I'm a big boy. Three, four. Would you like to? Uh, hop uh, 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 <laughs> I, oh, thank you. <clears throat> I'm. I'm. I can do this. Uh, uh, okay. Maybe if I go sideways. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, there we go. See, told you I could do it myself. Uh, if you do. You, uh, it's on my body cam. Oh, delightful! Why has this policeman got his gun out? He, he seems very. I feel like I'm in got to the secret service. Oh, that was an elevator. I took the elevator down. It's currently out of commission. Someone keeps breaking it. Oh, well that's silly. If he silly. decides to go into this room, sir. So. Oh, oh, am I getting my pictures taken? You are getting your pictures taken. Okay, if you can just face the, uh, if you could face me, turn around, sir. Okay. Okay. Looking at the whiteboard, it, it seems a little bit silly. Cheese. Okay. You are. Do you have any cheese? You're, you're around six foot two. Oh well. The ladies love it. <laughs> oh, sorry, six one. What? No, six two. Oh, it can be a bit hard when you walk. Well, you took your sunglasses off, you silly Billy. And uh, you already cheesed about cheese. I would love some okay, cheese. Okay, sir. Can you just uh, follow me? Is that, a, is that a no to cheese? Okay. Fine. I like cheese. But... Do you like I... cheese? I do like cheese. Oh, wonderful. Do, do, you, do you like cheese? Che do you like cheese plates? I would love some cheese. Do you like cheese and grapes? I mean, I, I, I mean I'm not a Roman emperor, but uh, you know, I can't be accustomed to them. Okay. Wait, where, where do I go from here? Do I, do I, do, do I have a new job? Just cell to your left, please. Ooh, I like the way your brain works. <laughs> just in there. Do I just sit on the floor, or what? Um, um, you could just come back to the bars for us so we can take those handcuffs oh, oh okay hey do you want me to get a court date book um i don't need to go to court you silly man oh there you go thank you Freedom. Uh, Bill. or yeah. just book him it all yeah. all happen in the yeah. procedure yeah. or um i'm just enter uh, there that's what okay. the booking office is for. 
Do so. I get some cheese and grapes or? If you go to a very fancy prison, you will. Oh. Do I not get cheese and grapes now or? I'm afraid not, sir. Oh. You get them. Well, um, this isn't a very good hotel. You get you get brown bread with butter, and um, some wet, watery mashed potatoes. And uh, when does room service come? What time is breakfast in the morning? Um, so we will uh, wake you up at around um eight between seven and eight a.m. Is there a pool or? No, uh, we'll wake you you up at around eight a.m. Then your breakfast will be here at nine nine um eight, sorry you'll be woken up at 8 a.m and then your breakfast will be brought to you at a between 8 30 and 9 a.m and then you uh, can either stay in your then you stay in your cell and then at around uh, 1 p.m you will get your lunch and then at around 6 p.m. you will get your dinner. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess I'll just sit here then. Hmm. Okay, Mr. Reginald. Uh, what do you want to do uh, from here, Phil? We'll just leave him. Quick okay. Enough, so we'll take him. Who's at the phone now? I'll get it. I'll get the phone. I guess I'll pull out then. Yeah, okay. Let me, let me just double check that cell is locked. Oh, sir! Beep a dee boop a dee! <laughs> let me just, I'm, I'm playing on the computer. Um, Phil, can I get you down here? Uh, he's messing with the computer, sir. I will have to tase you. Beepity boopity. Reginald is free. Uh, the computer sir, says I'm allowed off. Oh, ignore no. that one. My, the computer uh, says he, he's, he, he, I am me, free. Sir. But uh, I have Come to. On, sir. Uh, we don't want to do anything more dangerous. I know, but I had to. He was um, messing with our files. But it says. Reginald Dunsbury is free. Okay, you haven't. Computer. You're you're about to click enter. Yeah, yeah. Well, I don't know how to work computers. I'm still used to the pager and the good old fax machine. Sir. I thought I was allowed to go. The door was open. Nobody closed the door behind me. Well, uh, it's kind of an electronic system, so it just shuts. Oh. I didn't see that. <laughs> okay. I will sit here then, again. Alright, well, we're going to have to get med medical out to remove those tapes from the cell, aren't we? Oh, uh, I think I, I can pull them out. Or oh, the custody nurse. I think medical is very busy today. Okay, so we'll just... That's the right plan. If you would like, I can call for EMS. Like I said, I'm very manly. Okay. Okay. That really hurt, though, so uh, if you could just turn around so I can whimper, that'd be nice. Thank you. Oh, oh. Um. So yeah. Okay. Bye bye. Okay. Bye bye. I'm a. I'm a go through my um. The the special door for PD only. 